Hey everybody, welcome back. It's Ben Murphy. I'm a realtor with eXp here at Lexington, Kentucky. Welcome back to Living in Lexington. Ladies and gentlemen, today we are doing another Top Neighborhoods Review Series and we are going to go back to Lexington this time and we're going to go check out a neighborhood called Blackford. All right, everybody. So we are on nextdoor.com is, is a great website. I've talked about it in just about every single one of my neighborhood videos because it is worth your time. Now, it's really cool. It's kind of like an official Facebook group, but it's, it's a little bit more serious than that. A little bit more informational. Even has a chat board, okay, in case something's going on. I've seen lost pets on here. I've seen, um, you know, children, you know, missing children, stuff like that, where they're just like playing around. They just don't know where they're at. It's kind of crazy. Um, how quickly you can find some people, but I mean, restaurants nearby, you talk about Malone's, uh, Myers, which is, uh, like a nicer, cleaner Walmart Ramsey's, you know, it's, it's really, really cool. It's worth your time. If you, even if you aren't moving to Lexington, this site has just about every neighborhood you could think about. Um, the ones that are maybe in still development may not be included, but let me tell you, it's really worth your time. Now I wanted to just get on here real quick, just to show you where it is and what it looks like so blackford okay you got blackford oaks as well which is kind of a part of it which uh, really entails this section right here now we talked about greenbrier before we talked about home place glen eagles this is truly one of the, like the top areas that lexingtonians are definitely trying to move to and as i zoom out you see more and more neighborhoods here in lexington kentucky i know this kind of gets a little crazy I wanted to just focus mostly on blackford today but again, zoomed real close this time. You can really see just kind of how it looks. You know, it's a really cool little neighborhood. The homes are nice out there, especially right next to Greenbrier and Glen Eagles, two easily of the top areas here in the Lexington area. Let's jump over to Google real quick. Now you can kind of see Lexington in regards to where the neighborhood is. So that's the neighborhood. That's downtown Lexington. So as you can see, it's about just on the outskirts of Lexington. Now, the further out Lexington you get, more land you can get. The homes get a little bit nicer. Um, you're not so compact. The homes are newer outside of New Circle. So New Circle is this road right here. There's a bill here in the area that prevents any new constructions happening inside the circle. And I don't know, not my department. I just tell you where the homes are at. But I mean, seriously, there are some newer homes here in the area that are definitely worth your time and definitely worth looking at. But we'll zoom in kind of over here where Blackford is. Again, right next to Greenbrier, which is kind of, again, one of the top neighborhoods in the area. It's right next to Glen Eagles, the home place. We've done a bunch of different neighborhood tour videos of these different areas. And, um, you know, Andover Forest is another big one. I need to do Brighton East. That's a really nice neighborhood. Autumn Ridge is another one. Like you just got nice neighborhood after nice neighborhood over here in this section. And it's not too far from Jacobson Park, which was in my top five video parks you got to check out here in Lexington. It is really, really nice park. I enjoy going there. It's got a, probably the coolest dog park in the area. And so we'll zoom out just a little bit again. Just kind of want to show you where everything is. You know, you're really close to the highway, which is really nice. So even if you are not even trying to work in Lexington, you could be working in Georgetown. You'll be there in 30 minutes, easily, 25 minutes from there. And you're probably 25 minutes from Richmond. Okay. So say you work at Eastern Kentucky University, but you don't want to live in Richmond. You want to live closer to Lexington. You have opportunities and options when it comes to living in this um, part of the state of Kentucky. It's really cool, actually. And even if you want to work in the state capital of Frankfurt, which is right up here, you've got the highway system right there, which is awesome. Again, it, Lexington is kind of unique and one of the only major cities in the United States that doesn't have a highway system or a river that runs right through it. You know, the closest thing we got to a river is the Kentucky River, which is just south of Lexington. And the highway comes, as you can see, just on the outside of the city itself. So it kind of comes near it, but doesn't run right through it. So it's a little bit unique, but that can also be a downside. We talk about it in our pros and cons video. 
traffic can be a little bit nuts uh, when it comes to trying to navigate inside the circle. I mean, it really is. It's it's from 7 to 8 a.m. You really don't want to be on the road. From 5 to 6, you definitely don't want to be on the road. Uh, my wife works at the University of Kentucky. Takes her 25, 30 minutes just to get to the highway. No matter what direction she goes. Um, this route, it kind of goes straight here to this Paris Pike exit. It's probably the fastest route on there. But, I mean, this is Winchester Road. It'll take you all the way to Blackford itself. So, just kind of understand when you are moving to this area, traffic is probably going to be your biggest issue. But it's only during two times of the day. The rest of the time, traffic flows relatively easy here. Especially for the fact that we have 300,000 people that live in this tiny area of the state of Kentucky. So, just kind of understand that. But let's kind of zoom in over here because I talked about it before in other videos. This is one of the cooler areas of Lexington when it comes to shopping. You got Costco, Myers, which are two fantastic spots. If you go just a couple miles up the road, you got Kroger Marketplace. This is actually a really nice marketplace. It was one of, it was my for about two years before we ended up moving to Winchester. I really enjoyed it, but you know, I'm going to zoom in just a little bit more. So Malone's, Double Dogs, you can actually bring your dog out there. I'm not even kidding. It's a great little spot. Uh, Malone's is easily top top two, top three restaurants here in the area. If you want some, one of the best steaks you're ever going to have in your life, you definitely got to go there. Um, and, of course, you got the Steak and Shake, Chick-fil-A. There's Chipotle in there. If I zoom in more, you'll see it. Um, but you got more and more stuff. The more and more I zoom in, the more you kind of – begin to see what's all going on over here. So Malone's, you're right next to Drake's, which is a really cool hangout spot, especially during uh, football season, college football season, college basketball season. You can really enjoy yourself. Uh, you know, Red Lobster, which is a fan. Let's see, Bed Bath & Beyond, Men's Warehouse. I mean, it's just kind of crazy how much stuff's over here. I did a video about Crumble Cookies. You definitely got to check them out if you are in this area. It's probably some of the best uh, – um, cookies you're going to have in a long time i mean they are they're very big they're thick but they're they're not crunchy i wasn't about to say crunchy they're definitely not crunchy um, they're very soft great flavors I, I don't know i enjoy it i enjoy going back whenever i have a reason uh, regal hamburg which is a movie theater but then you got all these nice awesome stores you got dick sporting goods target my wife's favorite at home which is a uh, store that really you could decorate if you're a big seasonal decoration person you can definitely check them out i actually did a video about where to find the best halloween decorations uh, i do talk about at home and i show a little bit of at home so you should go check them out if you are into that as well and of course you got michael's best buy i mean this is truly one of the cool areas um you know there is another sh major shopping area that i'll point out before we move on we got to go south, though, all the way over here. There's your, there's your mall right across the street. You got more shopping over here as well, restaurants, dining. Uh, it's just, again, lots of, lots of stuff in a very, very tiny area. But we're going to jump in the car now. We're going to go show you what these homes look like. And, you know, check out some of the other videos where I talk about um, this area because I do touch base a little bit more deeper in um, some of the different areas but let's jump in the car and let's go check out these homes all right everybody before we get to that video tour do me a quick favor if you haven't already please click the like button definitely helps us get these videos out there helps us grow the channel and helps us reach out to more people who are trying to move to the Lexington area if you're one of those people please hit the subscribe button we're posting three to four videos every single week we're doing weekly market updates we're going to talk about reviews restaurants things to do this is definitely the channel you got to subscribe to if you are trying to research and learn more about the Lexington area. Let's get to the video tour.
much for watching everybody that does it for today's video if you hope you got to learn a little bit more about blackbird it is a great little spot great homes beautiful area really good shopping really good restaurants so please sure if you haven't already please click the like button it's going to help us get these videos out there let everyone know that what's going on also please subscribe if you are trying to move to the area you got to subscribe the final thing that you have to do ladies and gentlemen if you are planning to move to the lexington area shoot me an email shoot me a text let me know that you're on your way so that way we can go ahead and plan ahead and make sure we are ready for you and we can block off that time so that way we're devoted to you and we can make sure that we find you your next home and we know what's going on with the market so ladies and gentlemen thanks so much for watching this has been murphy i'm with exp here in lexington kentucky this is living in lexington y'all have a good day